What's up everybody? Blue Gabe here. We're somewhere in the middle of central Florida. I can't tell you where. Because you see my buddy over there, Andrew Hunt. He's twice my size and would probably beat me to death if I told y'all. Got James Lassner with us. We're here after crappie. We did put the boat in the lake and tried to come up with the boat. Ran into dry land, had to turn around and push it out. Now the boat's on the trailer. We're going to walk down this bank, start catching some specks, put the can cooker grill in the ground, and show y'all how it's done. We're going to catch, clean, and cook in one spot and never move. Hope y'all enjoy. What's his name? Mason. Y'all meet Mason. Mason, say hi. hi. Can you say hi? Hi. Hi. <laughs> Those of y'all that follow me on Instagram, it's Blue Gabe on Instagram too. Y'all know when I break out those board shorts, something good's about to happen. And look at look at Drew. He done showed up with his. Big shout out to all you guys for watching all my shows. It's mind blowing how fast this is starting. Absolutely mind blowing. And it's only going to get better. I'm only going to get better at filming. It's starting to come pretty natural. You'd think I'd be good at it by now. I've hung out with Robert for so long. A.K.A. deer meat. But, hey, everything's a learning curve. Right now, I'm about to go learn this canal and see if I can catch a crappie out of it. Look at that. One in the bucket. Y'all see how they do me? They leave me back at the truck to carry everything. I get here. If y'all notice Andrew, he was on the snook and cook we did for deer meat. He was also on the pompano video we did for deer meat. Oh, he was with us on the kids tournament one, the public freak out. He's just beginning to learn how to fish. He just got started a couple months ago, but he's actually catching on pretty quick, so. <laughs> yeah, look, you keep going, tend to them poles, he's gonna, here, you wanna catch You got him? one? No, you catch him. Come here. Come here and help your daddy. You wanna get this fish? Oh man, he's going. <laughs> Look at that nonsense. Just as quick as he got here, he's already catching them. And tell us the rules about these. So here in Lake Jackson, they gotta be 12 inches to keep. So this guy's gonna miss by a long shot. We weren't supposed to tell anybody where we were. Oh, whoops. We gotta redo that? No. <laughs> <laughs> it ain't much of a secret now. No, no. Hey. Look. He done fell in. <laughs> Y'all give us a big thumbs up if you appreciate taking your kids fishing. A lot of people opt out of taking them because it's easier to leave them home with mama or mama to leave them home with daddy. Sometimes you just ain't got a choice and that's what happened today. Plus we like to take them so it is what it is. Now I got to get to fishing. Uh oh. What you got? Looking like you might be a keeper. Son. Oh slab. Dang. Every time I try to set my stuff down to catch one, y'all are catching them. There's a little guy, but he wanted it bad. Fish on. Look at that, hooked him right in the back. <laughs> ah! Don't worry, I got him. If you can't hook him in the mouth, you might as well hook him in the back. You got one? <laughs> False alert, guys, he didn't have one. Oh. Almost a party foul. <laughs> Almost is the key word, y'all. I'm weeding out the little ones. That's what I'm saying. You're catching the bigger ones with that little one. Oh, I was about to say, I thought you said I was weeding it. I thought he's back there talking smack, y'all. Not yet. You get the small ones, we'll get the big ones. Look at this. Little Yo jerk bait minner. I bought it for peacock fishing a while back. Hadn't got around to using it. Voila. What do you got? 
What's that, Mason? Is that a fishy? Get him in here, son. I'm pretty for sure James in the lead. We don't know each other good enough for you to be out fishing me this bad. First time I've ever speck fished before. It's pretty easy. <laughs> Y'all hear that nonsense? James and I met today. He's out fishing me. What you looking at? I set that right on top of Say Say cheese. Hi. All right, y'all. I'm gonna show you how easy this grill is to set up. Didn't bring a hammer, but we got a reese hitch. Like that. Set up. All I gotta do is add charcoal and we're cooking. Do I? Look at him. I'm setting the grill up and he's still catching fish. That fish is about to go on this grill. Y'all, I can't even get a break. I'm trying to cook and get stuff ready and look what they're doing. All right, y'all, I'm only gonna show you how to clean one because we're running out of daylight. He's still alive. First thing we're gonna do is put him out of his misery. He ain't feeling nothing anymore. Quick scale them. Flip him over, same thing. Come over here in the canal. Rinse him off. Make sure. Look at that. Fish busting while we're getting ready to cook. I know some of y'all are worried about bacteria in that water. The heat of the grill's gonna cook that off. I ain't worried about it. Alligators gotta eat too. That's it. Sort of just like the bluegill catch, clean, and cook, but we're cooking this one on the grill, not fried. All right, y'all, same person who makes the grill makes the can. Just a little steamer can, put it in there. Drop your broccoli in. A little bit of water. Put the lid on it, clamp it down. Put that there. All right, let's get the corn ready. A little bit of butter. Here's the key ingredient. This stuff right here, something serious. In case y'all was wondering, they still bite me. Golly, I can't even cook without them. They're killing them. They're, but you know what? We're here biting. to catch, clean, and cook. They can catch, I'll clean and cook. But y'all, it's this easy. Slide it down into place. Let the corn get going. Got the broccoli in there. All right, regular beans. I don't know if y'all can see me. Little pocket knife, nothing special. Nothing special, but it'll get the trick done when you forgot your can opener. Take the wrapper off.
What do y'all think it'll be good or not? Let me see. Might be the trophy of the day there. Ooh. What y'all think about that? Mmm. Mm. And look right here. The water. Just looking at These it. fish have not touched ice yet. You hear a lot of people talking about fresh. These fish haven't even touched ice and we're about to eat them. That's fresh. Don't you think? <laughs> Alright y'all, we're going to do it fast and simple. Just a little bit of olive oil. Out of everything I could have forgot today, I forgot a spatula, which probably is going to make this relatively hard. But, you know you're cooking fresh when these guys' buddies flopping right there in the bucket. Original Creole, this stuff is so good. Take him to the grill. Ooh. Ooh. You know how many people are gonna watch this and be like, ew, you're standing in the water in the ditch in the mud. How in the world do you think our ancestors did it? Heck, my mom did it. That's my parents grew up catching and trapping animals and selling them for their lunch money in grade school because they were so poor they didn't have anything. <laughs> And that ditch wouldn't have bothered them, so that's how we're doing it. Can't help it if it grosses some of y'all out. It doesn't get any more wild, any more perfect any more better than this until somebody calls me all right broccoli's done time to to attempt uh-oh 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 look at that i wish y'all could smell like oh man ah. i need your honest opinion what? you gotta look at the camera yeah. does that food look good yes Look, don't, look. Don't mind me back here. Don't mind me. Back. What about you? Do you? What's your name? Howie. Oh, I forgot. What's your name? Hope. Y'all watch YouTube? Yes. I'll give you a bite if you follow my my YouTube page. Okay. Where are y'all from? St. Cloud, Florida. Well, we thought we had a honey hole to ourselves, and we got here, and they done beat us to it. <laughs> All right, let's fix some plates. All right, let's see what this corn looks like. Oh, with that butter garlic seasoning on top. Little piece of pepper. Oh, man, it's hot. Why didn't y'all remind me to bring a spatula? What's in the can? Baked beans. Oh, and we forgot the broccoli. Oh no. Harry, you have dinner in the car, but never mind. That's what I'm saying. <laughs> Y'all look at that. On a canal bank, catching them, putting them on the grill, cooking and eating. All right, let's say a prayer real quick. Dear Lord, thank you for this day. Thank you for this food. Thank you for all these wonderful fish and meeting new friends in the fellowship. Thank you for letting your son die on the cross to forgive us of our sins. In Jesus' name, amen. Amen. What's y'all's name? Gabriel. Gabriel. It's mine. Okay. It's hot, now blow on it. That's probably good enough. Thought you want your too. That's good. We'll make some of our own, sweetie. What do you think of that? <laughs> hot and hot. <laughs> Thank you very Thank much. Thank you. You're welcome. Appreciate it. Nice to meet y'all. And what's your page? The other one? Blue Gabe. Blue Gabe. Yeah, Blue Remember Gabe. Like Blue meat for dinner really Blue good. Gabe. Hey, you have a good, You know it's good when kids think it's good, y'all. 
<laughs> All right, y'all travel safe. Thank you, y'all too. Thank you. Nice meeting you. Let me try it now. Oh. Wait, what is it called again? Blue, the color blue. Uh -huh. Gabe, G-A-B-E. Okay. They'll be on there tonight. <laughs> it's on. Catch on. Give me that camera. Wait till you wait till you taste this. Don't want to leave these. Mmm, dude. Damn up, dude. <laughs> mm, don't get no fresher net. No <laughs> Drew, sure. come here and try this fish. Oh, I'm telling y'all right now. Fish don't get no better than that, and I'm not saying it because I cooked it. If it wasn't good, I would be the first person to tell y'all. Mmm. You see that right there? Here's the taste. Oh man. What is that seasoning? I'm gonna put the link to the seasonings in the description below, but we're gonna change something up on this video. Y'all don't go anywhere because I got some awesome footage from a job that I did earlier today. Me and my dad up in Palm Beach. Y'all watch this. We, work, we play, we work, and we play some more. This is what you call a big stem wall footer, bringing all the dirt up a foot higher than the block. Man, I didn't even really get a chance to eat that. Mm. This fish. Go. Every time I've tried to do something, he's caught a fish. Oh, look at that copper top there. That's a bluegill. Big old copper top. We done did a bluegill show, y'all. We can't do one. Is that funny? Did you try the corn yet? Oh man. With that buttered that garlic? Butter garlic is Ooh. Serious, Ooh, look out. Look out. Very good. Let me see. Ow. Mm. Mm -hmm. If y'all ever get a chance, go cook on the bank. Don't even put the fish on ice. Clean them and cook them. Catch, clean, and cook them right on the bank. It don't get no better. Hey, give him kissing the fish. Give him a kiss. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. You gonna give him a kiss? Give him a kiss. Give him a kiss. <laughs> oh. Hey, bye bye. Bye bye. <laughs> mm. You see, we came out here with a plan. The first plan didn't work. We just rebounded it and did the second plan, and it worked flawlessly. Mm. Don't get no better. All right, well, I hope y'all enjoyed this video. It was a blast doing it. We drove up here with the intentions to go on the boat, ended up fishing in the canal, which might have been a blessing. You never know. We cooked right here on the bank. The fish never touched ice. I rinsed them off in the canal water. You don't, you don't need anything fancy to have a good time and a good meal. Until next time, please like and subscribe. Share me with your friends if you can or if you would. Really appreciate it. We gone.